How's it and welcome back to another episode of Hawaiian Horology. Today I got hands on with the new Omega Speedmaster, the white dial version. And I'm going to let you guys know a little something that I haven't been hearing in any other videos about this watch. So here we go. So I stopped by the boutique today just to take a look at the new uh, Omega Speedmaster, the new lacquer white dial. It just dropped on March 5th and I went in the day after. I was in contact with my um, authorized dealer there and she said they didn't have any for sale but they did have one on display that I could check out. So I went over there, I checked it out and this did not disappoint at all. I really think that this is the Speedmaster I'm going to get. I made a video earlier um, asking for all you guys' help to help me choose between the Hesalite or the um, Sapphire Sandwich, but I'm actually glad I didn't purchase it when I kind of wanted to purchase it. I was going to get the Sapphire version, but looking at this dial, this new colorway, it is actually... The watch that I've been waiting for. It has some of the things that I thought the other Speedmasters were lacking. Like, if you look at these side by side, they are very different. And one of the things I wanted to point out that none of the other videos I've seen are talking about is the applied indices on this watch. And it is a very nice contrast. When you see it in person, the lacquer dial is very stunning and with these applied indices that's what i think some of the other models are missing i know like the hesalate version is a tool watch everything's painted on there and it went to the moon and da 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 but i think at this price point even the black dial sapphire sandwich not having applied indices is kind of a negative for me and this really takes it to another level and this will be the watch that i think i'm going to purchase so hopefully my authorized dealer will give me a call soon, and once I do get it in hand, I'll have a full review. But thanks again for watching another episode of Hawaiian Horology, and I'll see you on the next one. Shoot!